I know that just because you are good at it, not to toot my own horn, <laughs> but there's there's some obvious levels to it and unless you experience different things with paint and, and sculpting and and everything else, you know, I don't I don't wanna be like just one style painter. There was a bartender underneath this face standing crazy like one leg over here one leg down here and he was pouring a bottle that was right here into a wine glass which is underneath that torch and the way you seen the bartender was like kind of like a bird's eye view like staring at him from like the top and it just turned into this this person in the garden this is me hanging on for their life. And my kids hanging on for no reason. This is the winter right here. That's my other daughter, Michaela. And this is the road that I take to get her because she lives about, it's like a three hour commute, basically. You know what I mean? So uh, underneath all that stuff, it was just like a painting of me and them and the road and the road said like, five days, three hours away. And that's what it was, five days, three hours away. You know what I mean? And that's my building. Tati right here, cook dinner every day. Appreciate that. This is Dallas, that's D-Dot. That's how that came about. This one tape right here, I thought that was perfect. I've been using that a lot. That's one thing or another. His style is like my style, you know, different. Like I would like to start incorporating more realistic stuff in there with my primitive neo-expressionism. And I listen to him, I listen to what he has to say. And I came across this Indian philosopher and I ended up listening to him on my way to work, you know what I mean? And I drive an hour to work and he talked about fear on how to eliminate fear I'm a little into like Greek Roman Egyptian mythology and I came across this person right here which is called a Hori in Islam when Islam first became a religion and a lot of this stuff like the where it's just put together and it, it's called neo-expressionism. Basquiat, George Kondo. I like that Picasso could draw like realistic things. I listen to Lauryn Hill a lot when I paint. Bob Marley, Wu-Tang Clan, uh, A Tribe Called Quest. I use that to like get inspired, but when it comes to doing what I do, it's, it's, it's completely different, you know? So that's why it's hard, because it's like doing something new every time. It's Hopefully further than what it's gonna be in the next two years. <laughs> you know, I would like to have my art put in a gallery, just like showcasing myself. I don't wanna say like have my own gallery, but if that's what it takes to get my painting in a gallery, then <laughs> why not, you know what I mean? <laughs>